Hello everyone, welcome to the Software Coding Tutorials channel. My name is Tommy. Today I will be talking about Tuple in C++. For this tutorial, I will demonstrate to you how to create a tuple and use it in the C++ programming. And a tuple is an object that can hold a number of elements. The elements can be of different data types. The elements of tuples are initialized as argument in order in which they will will be accessed. Okay, so let's jump into Visual Studio Code. And I'm going to go and create a new directory, a new folder. And I'm going I'm to call it tuple. And in the tuple directory, I'm going to go ahead and create a new file. And, and I will call it tuple.cpp. Okay. And in tuple.cpp, I'm going to go ahead and declare include tuple include string include io stream include map include vector and then declare using namespace standard okay and i'm going to go and create a map object so standard map string and it's going to map to a tuple so the tuple will contain um, the first last name uh, team scores and seasons of uh, NBA players so so I'm going to call this map uh, lookup Okay, so um, I'll go ahead and create a function called make player. So void make player void, and I'll go ahead and do a lookup, right? Lookup of uh, Bryant. Okay, Kobe Bryant, right? And I'll do a standard make tuple of Kobe Bryant with LA Lakers and um, his score is 33,643 uh, and then basically the number of seasons will be 20 seasons and I'll do lookup of Magic Johnson, right? Johnson has uh, so so type in Magic Johnson and team will be LA Lakers and he scored seventeen thousand seven hundred seven points and he did it in thirteen seasons. And I'll do this for Michael Jordan. And I'll do standard make tuple Michael Jordan. And he belongs to Chicago Bulls. And he scored 32,292 points and 15 seasons later. Okay, so that's the function for uh, creating the tuple. And I'll go ahead and um, do another function. And it's going to be um, to get player, right? So we, we basically make a function called make player. Now we do get player. So 
this function will return a tuple string string int int so basically it would match with uh, what we define in our dictionary or I'm sorry map so get player and we just put in the player's name and it, sh it should return a tuple right? so return uh, lookup right. so that's what it should look like and um, in our main routine so we're going to declare int main void and I'm going to go ahead and declare um, a couple variable here right so string um, name and uh, so I guess I could say string player and uh, team right so basically it will match with uh, player team and an int um, score and then uh, seasons right so the number of seasons so seasons okay and um, I'm gonna go ahead and create a vector right vector string names equal to be Bryant Johnson and then Jordan okay and uh, basically I'm gonna loop through the vector okay so for int c equals 0 c less than names size c++ then um, basically I'm gonna do a tie right so why why do I need to do a tie so tie is a, f a method that allows me to unpack the tuple so standard tie and I'm gonna associate with player right um, team and then score and then seasons equal to get player and then the name of the player right so names right. and I'll go ahead and basically do a standard out of the player right. and um, team just go to the next line I'm gonna go ahead and do team and then tap then score then tap then seasons and end line okay and uh, that should complete our main I'm gonna go ahead and do a return zero okay so this is a gonna be a quick example of how we create tuple so let's save this file and let's open a terminal okay and I'll go ahead uh, and go into the terminal this is our directory and CD to tuple and let me clear this so you can see everything here so we type in G++ tuple.cpp dash standard equal to C++17 and uh, this should produce a file do an ls again we got a dot out so let's type in a dot out oops and we got some problems here let's double check
Oh, that's because um, I didn't call make players yet, right? We call this routine, but we didn't call make player. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, right above uh, the vector, I'll go ahead and call make player. Okay, as you can see here, and then save. Let's go to our terminal. Let's do a clear. Recompile the code. Ls type dot a dot out, and you can see that here's the output for all um, of these players uh, that score win those number of seasons okay so thank you very much for watching this uh, very short tutorial please remember to press like and subscribe to support my channel if you like these kind of tutorial and thank you very much see you next time